Hello people, it's me, Right1196, and today we're going to be playing some more Minecraft. Now, if you guys haven't noticed, it looks different. <gasps> what is this? Yes, I cleared out some area over there. As you can tell, that's up there. It's all doing good. The cows are mooing and it's really loud. And ooh, man, that looks pretty. Well... Recently, I've been working on Minecraft a little bit by myself, and I know that's kind of bad, but I really haven't had much time to record because it's been really, really loud, and I just can't, I can't record whenever it's being really loud, but as of right now, I can record. I am using a new mic, if you guys might notice. Uh, let me check something quickly. Mm. Okay. So, let's see what we have going on here. It's pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm fixing to start working on the third floor. Getting that all finished up. Everything seems to be growing quite well. And I had a suggestion by a person on YouTube saying, "Why don't you put hoppers under here? It'll be a little bit better." From, uh, for the collect uh, for them to collect and I can understand where you're coming from but I kind of can't do that with this tight space up here it's just kind of look for looks right now I kind of like it just whenever all the pumpkins are fully grown or all the melons are fully grown so sorry I probably won't be doing that doing the little hopper thing under here but yeah, that's uh, that's what that looks like. So I'm just gonna bring you guys up to date on what I've been doing. Now for this episode, we're gonna be focusing on a tree farm. Now what I've been figuring out is how high the uh, the trees really need to be, and I think it's six blocks. So let's count this: one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, six in the air. And we're making something over here that's going to relate to that in some way. Now, what's going to happen is that I'm going to build a little platform that leads up to this platform. As you can tell, it's just a ring. And the saplings will grow on this ring. And right here will be a collection chamber. Now, I still haven't dug everything out. This is just, um, this is just what I've been doing off camera. I've been just digging um, I will inform you whenever I get everything dug out. So, yeah. And let's go check on the farm up there. I'm going to pause the video and I'll meet you guys up there. Now, I just noticed something. Every time I mash F8, which is my unpause button, it brings me into a weird camera zoom thing. So, I might have to fix that. Okay, I'm going to pause the video right here. <laughs> okay, guys, so we're back up here. And I'm taking just a little bit of damage. So, do I not have anything to eat? Okay, I guess I'll just eat this. Okay, there we go. Stop. Okay, so let me inform you about the mob spawner trap up here. It's kind of loud. Let me turn down the volume. There we go. Seven seems quite reasonable. Okay. So, I have stood over here for about 30 minutes. And let's see what kind of drops we have. Oh my god. <laughs> this is all the gunpowder that has been accumulated. Which, that that is impressive for me because I've never had this much gunpowder and on this side we just have a bunch of other things over here we have just bones and stuff so I'm pretty proud of the spawner right now it's you know the spawner has been working really well and this spawner will give us a lot more opportunities to things now I've been wondering, should I put 
should I do something up here besides have a spawner? I would love to have like a cool village up here that that would benefit me in some way. Let's just say that. Now I don't know how I'm going to build it, but if I do or if I am, I want I want to hear your guys suggestions. I really want to hear it. Okay, so I have died a total of 4 times now. I jumped off this ledge, not knowing, and I died again. <laughs> My mistake. I'm an idiot whenever I get up here. So, let's see what we can do. We're going to make some wool, and we might make a cool little thing out of wool. I, I, I'm really... I don't know what I should do, to be honest. Okay, let's see here. Let's get out some stuffs. 30 wool blocks, that's perfectly fine with me. I don't really have to have a sheep farm because I got this farm and it produces probably even more wool than a normal sheep farm would. And I scratched, actually, I scratched that. Uh, it probably doesn't, depending on how big the farm is. But I am perfectly fine with how much stuff we have. It was already over here. We're just going to use most of the string. We're not going to use all of it. But we're going to make just a... Oh, man, I have the hiccups today. We're going to use just a bunch of wool blocks. We're going to make just a bunch of wool blocks. I'm sorry. There we go. Got a bunch. I'm going to save this 34 string. Or 35. Sorry. Can't really talk today, to be honest. So... This wool, I suppose, is going to be used for the village that we're going to be building up here. That is one of the projects that I'm going to be working on. And I will be working on this project either on camera and off camera at the same time. Maybe build a couple of houses on camera and then build a couple of houses off camera. So if you guys want to see me build all the houses on camera, please leave a comment below. If you guys don't, then still leave a comment saying that you don't want to see me build the houses and it'll be fine if I can build them off camera. Okay. So I'm also I also have a new mic. If you guys have noticed, it's a Turtle Beach mic. So it's it's a it's an upgrade. Tell me how you guys think of the new mic. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Do you think I should go back to my other mic? Does this mic sound better than the other one? And that's about it. Also, you guys are going to be surprised because I recently found out how to install Optifine without having Windows 7 zip. So, we are on Minecraft 1.6.4 right now. Now, you guys might be thinking, why are you on 1.6.4 whenever you got whenever you can be on 1.7.2 or 1.7.4? And my 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 answer to that would be the lag purposes. I don't like lag, and I especially don't like playing Minecraft with a tiny render distance. Judging by the fact that I have a good computer that can run Minecraft at a high frame rate, I don't see any point at running Minecraft at a low setting, like at a, such a low setting. I don't see why Minecraft puts me on such a low setting, or it's kind of hard to explain. Like, I know my computer is better than this, if, if that's what I'm trying to say. Like, I try to play Feed the Beast, and it lags all over the place, and I know my computer should be able to handle it, but it doesn't. That's why I don't record Feed the Beast. <laughs> I rarely even play Feed the Beast that often, just because of the tiny render settings that I'm on. But anyway, let's check out. We are on Optifine 1.6.4 HD Ultra C6. There is also a, an, I think there's an update to it. So yeah. Now, for if you guys have any other questions, let me know. I want to, I want to hear some questions in the comment box below. And if you guys like this video, please leave a like and subscribe. So this is mostly just an informing video. It's not anything new. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching. It's been cool. And peace out.